All right, Shalom. I want to start by saying, Kahalo, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Kakadash. Double honor to the positive of Israel, aka the positive Great Millstone. And peace and love to all the Akin. Continue to preach the truth and all truth sincerity. All right, real quick, as you look at the screen, uh, it's an email I got. And basically, it's from the, uh, if the people don't know, you know, people that's kind of like an investment world and whatnot, you have this thing called the Motley Fool, which is kind of like, it's kind of like a, um, confidant as far as uh, investing in stocks or what stocks to invest to that's going to be able to make you some money. Now, I've been subscribed to it for a little while now. I don't really dabble into it too much like that anymore. Sometimes I look to see what they got going on. But this email they sent me today, this morning, actually really intrigued me. It said, credit cards are dying and this is skyrocketing. And like I said before, so the Molly Fool, basically in a nutshell, they give you advice. They give you um, suggestions, basically, on stocks that would be nice to invest in. So it says, a uh, fellow investor says, oh my, thank you for your response yesterday. But with the 80% new member discount on Motley Fool Stock Advisor, I shouldn't be too surprised. Today, I want to briefly talk about a new trend expo exploding in Asia. It's hard to fathom what's happening in urban China these days unless you've seen it firsthand. Tourists and visitors are often shocked to discover they can't even buy a piece of fruit from a roadside vendor with their wallet. So it means with uh, hard cash, tangible cash. People are leaving their cash and credit cards at home and opting to use something else to pay instead. Now, the reason why I'm bringing this up, because what does that really sound like they're gearing to? What does it sound like they're leading to? All right, they're leading towards that karagma, where they, the one that they cause of all, both small and great, rich and poor, to receive that mark, okay? To read that incision, okay? Ah. It says, and this trend is starting to spread. And while it may not be good for credit card companies, it is good for investors that are paying close attention. Which lucky, which lucky for you, we compile. Uh, now, this is you know one of the chain emails they sent to all of the people that are uh, uh, subscribed to it or whatever. It says, we compli compiled a report on four stocks that will benefit from this. If you're still on the fence about getting all of our thoroughly researched stock picks and I would suggest you invest in this incredible revolution spilling it out in China, let me clue you in a smart, in a smart way, into a smart way to join. Now, if you think about it, it could be nothing, but you know how this, all this stuff with this pandemic started in uh, Wuhan, China. Now, all of a sudden, they got this new thing in China, and they're saying that the credit card companies will be sh pushed out, okay? That's how you know that, like, the, the, they're getting leaning towards getting rid of cash, and it's going to be a cashless society and a cashless world. Now, this is just, you know, this is whatever they, they are talking to. So, um, this is like the, uh, I don't, uh, what's the actual investments? Let me see. But yeah, that's really it. Uh, I just want to bring out this email. So that goes, you know, what is it going to? It's going to the scriptures, Revelation the 13th chapter. Hold on, let, let's get it. It's 16. This is the book of Revelation, chapter 13, verse 16. Now, now granted, we read this scripture all, all the time, but it's getting more and more prevalent and it's getting more and more closer. So we have to keep pushing this and, and, and telling the people and telling the world that this is what they're about to do. And this is all tied to biblical prophecy. Now, it reads, um, and he calls of all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. Now, granted, this is what, the, what they're talking about is not actually the chip. Now it's not actually the chip, but it's all leaning towards that that's that that beast uh, mark. All right, it's all leading towards it. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I'm bringing this email because, as you can see, they're getting more and more in the digital realm of currency, which means ultimately what the last the last stage to that is going to be what that RFI. All right, because that's 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 the, that's the, we in the last days. So this devil's doing the last day prophecies that he's. That has to that has to be fulfilled from your Halabashim Al Shah for this place to be destroyed. But ultimately, if you do take this, you'll be destroyed. So that's why I have to continue to pray for faith and and and, and listen to the prophets that are telling you not to get it. Because at the end of the day, the people that are gonna get it are the people that didn't listen. But and the people that do listen and get it, those are gonna be the ones that are gonna be destroyed anyway. That's why it's very fearful things to fall into the hands of the living power, man. Because even though you got brothers that notice that you probably got some brothers that will take the shit. Or, or be very, very tempted to take the chip, 
All right, because I don't want to put that on any brother. But at the end of the day, some, like people are going to get it. And it said more shall perish and be saved. All right, that's why you have to continue to always pray and trust in the Lord, man. So no matter what they, these devils throw at you that's going to cause you to have to get this, you have to still not get it. All right, maybe you might get thrown in prison. You might get, you might get, uh, you might be put to death. You might be so on and so forth, man. It's going to get uncomfortable at the end of the day. You just have to not take it because I, you rather fall victim to a uh, man's hands than to the um, heavenly father, man. And the heavenly father said you'll for surely be destroyed if you get this, if you get this inserted in your body, man. Now, granted, he started off with this, with this um, C-19V, but what, what, what's, what's happening now, he's getting more and more closer to what he's really trying to do. All right. So, you know, with that, that's why I want to just bring that out to, you know, how we getting closer and closer to that, to that Karagma, man. All right, with that, I'm going to say, you know, all praise to you. How about Shalom.